whether it's buying a computer online or directly in the store. Both cases have their advantages and disadvantages. At the beginning, I want to emphasize that shopping online is much cheaper than shopping in a store. As for shopping in the store, I know that some people like it because they want to see what they are buying in person. The advantage of buying at the store is that the seller can dedicate more time for you and you can ask him anything that comes to your mind about the device. As for smaller stores, if you want to boost your computer later, they will be happy to do so because you have previously bought a computer from them. When it comes to buying a computer online, the advantages are, in addition to the lower price, a much larger range of components that you can choose from. Far greater choice of sellers, but also the ability to buy each component varies cheaper. The obvious drawback is that some sites charge for shipping, but some of them don't. Also, before purchasing, find out who pay the cost of shipping and reshipping if the device gets broken down. Another big drawback is that it is much easier to explain the problem you have in the store than over the internet or a phone call. Sometimes it happens that the person on the other side does not write down a sufficiently detailed description of your problem, so the service technician cannot find or fix the problem. In one situation I returned the headphones that didn't have a base on the left side. Since they failed to write it down, the headphones were tested and returned it to me. Probably a repairman played a ballad and found that the headphones were working normally. Only after the second sending the fault was noted. So I had to call again, explain the problem in details and then put a piece of paper in the headphone box on which I described the malfunction in detail and recommended that they listen to a song with a bass. Another advantage of shopping online is that you can browse the various components and explore their specifications in a relaxed and unhurried way. And there is also a lot of comments and reviews online. In order to buy something, you don't even have to leave the house and the goods will arrive at your door. And of course, if the store from which you bought a computer closes, try to make a complaint directly with the manufacturer. If you like the video, leave a comment and don't forget to subscribe.